the stretching feline. We've all seen it a time or a billion. <laughs> What's that old expression? I'd stretch a mile if I didn't have to walk back. I'm not sure who exactly coined that, but it could have been a cat, just saying. In this material, I'll give you the rundown on why cats not only stretch, but more specifically stretch when they see you. Yes, you. You right there. I'm talking to you. So get all limbered up, because I've got you covered. Stay tuned. Let's just say you open that front door after a long day at work, and there's your cat right there. Stretch, stretch, just stretching up a storm. Let's call this cat Walter, just for no particular reason. Walter, good old Walter. Uh, why does he have a habit of doing this stretching routine? Some type of feline yoga, yeah? Does he do this often, but does he seem to do it right when he sees you, almost regardless of the circumstances? Once you pick up on this, you'll probably find yourself seeing it all the time. But why does Walter do this, those yoga poses and such? Well, the first reason is to greet you, just to say hello. Stretching, in this example, has nothing to do with those stiff muscles and the effort to get all loose and limbered up. The stretch is a greeting and a sign of trust. Because, let's be honest, take your personal goofiest stretches. You don't really break those out in the middle of a shopping mall, do you? <laughs> See what I mean? It's like eating spaghetti in a public restaurant, public place. Not everyone is game for that, and the stretching, it's an act of trust and comfort. Walter is greeting you. Another reason why feline stretch is an act of attention. Cats are pretty smart to how us humans are wired. They know that if they do something cute or something just blatantly obvious and maybe borderline ridiculous, <laughs> there's a respectable chance they'll receive something in return. Some pets, some food, some snack treats, a play session. Here again, just like stretching as a way to greet you, stretching for attention has little to do with loosening up those muscles and more to do with getting you to notice them. The next reason why cats stretch Walter and the rest of the group is, finally, you guessed it, uh, to get that body in motion. Cats do this for the same reason that we stretch. However, with respect to the topic, if your cat stretches in front of you, especially after it's obvious they've been napping, the stretching is likely done with the expectation that some type of interaction is just around the corner. Sure, the cat is attempting to wake up and get those muscles moving, but the act itself could be due to the assumption that you're about to do something cool and they either want to see it or take part. Another quick and casual example of a human nature. How many times have you seen a cat, not even your cat per se, uh, perhaps in the neighborhood, the neighborhood cat? How many times have you been out uh, walking about and you see them sound asleep, but they wake up, stretch, and roll around and do all those good things simply because they heard you or they saw you? The fact that you were up and about made them want to get up and move about. Some cats, especially if they're very trusting, they'll spring into action sometimes because you're in the action mode and they don't want to miss a thing. And keeping with that up and about theme, some cats will stretch in front of their owners because they need the release, the need to take advantage of that moment, simply for themselves. Because for so much as cats sleep and certainly love to sleep, healthy cats need to get up and move about. If a cat realizes that you're moving, they could view that as a chance to just wake up and do something for themselves, whatever it is, simply to shake off those cobwebs and move about following a long nap. As a human example, how many times have you personally been asleep and you say you just heard something loud outside or perhaps just other people talking and moving about? And even if you didn't want to get up, well, heck, you, you probably thought to yourself, I probably should just go ahead and get on up. Get moving, not for any reason or for any one, just for the simple fact that, hey, it's probably just time to get up. So other people sort of coax you to get up in that, in that regard. Another reason why cats will stretch in the presence of their owners is to release tension and anxiety. And this is an interesting one. If a cat is a bit on edge and unsure, they will stretch. And while stretching is not a regular thing, uh, some cats will attempt to almost mask their fears by attempting to showcase that everything is just fine. Stretching and acting comfortable can sometimes be, let's just say it, an act. Here again, back to our real-world human and uh, real-world human examples. Uh, this probably happens on a daily basis around the globe. How are you today? How are things going? Oh, I'm just, uh, I'm fine, man. I can't complain. High five, big smile. Things have never been better. When in truth, things are trash. How are things going? Trash. Can't complain. Yeah, right. I've got a laundry list of complaints. Where do I begin? That smile, well, it's to cover up everything. 
As we turn for home in this video, another reason why cats will stretch when they see you is to mark territory. It's all about those pheromones, scent marking. The bigger the stretch, the larger the presence. In the same way, the cats will love to rub against their owners in an effort to mark and claim them. Scent marking via stretching is often done in an effort to claim various portions of the home. This is common if the cat in question resides in a multi-cat or multi-pet household. And the final reason I'll talk about today is by far the silliest of them all. But personally, in many ways, it could frankly be the most common. <laughs> and that is uncertainty, as in, oh, wow, uh, the one who loves and takes care of me, uh, hello, uh, I'm not sure what to do right now, so I'm going to stretch your cat caught with their fur down. <laughs> Let's call it caught with their fur down. Another human example, have you ever seen people who just didn't know what to do with their hands? Someone on stage giving a big speech and those hands and arms in their pockets, swinging up and down, clasped together. Another example involves meeting someone famous. You were just sort of rocking back and forth, not sure what to say, where to stand, how to stand, fixing your clothes, <laughs> rubbing your nose. You're uncomfortable, uh, you just start doing random things because you don't know what else to do because I don't know uh, who's big today. Let's say you met Taylor Swift, <laughs> not sure what to do, where to stand, how to act. Sometimes cats will just uh, stretch because in that moment they're just out of options. They don't know what to do or how to act, so they stretch. So, uh, cat got your tongue? <laughs> stretch. That's a wrap. Some of the most common reasons why cats of Walter, in this case, will stretch in front of you. Uh, did your cat stretch while watching this video? If so, type Walter in the comment section. To the audience of Senior Cat Wellness, your thoughts on this topic? Is your cat a regular when it comes to this behavior? Have you figured out the core reason behind the stretching when you're around? Uh, do you have some theories, your stories, general commentary, anything, and everything in between? Comment section. As always, it's all yours. And if you enjoyed this content, please give the video a like and subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you as a member of the Senior Cat Wellness family. And until next time, thank you so very much for watching, and I will talk to you later.